Bird Shadow here, and welcome back to Crush Crush. So previously, I got through with the phone fling with Amelia, and I showed off all of Renee's outfits. And now, well, considering it took me two weeks to get to the first phone fling to begin with, the next part of it is already available, so... Yeah, it literally just all worked out. So I guess let's not waste too much time and get straight to it. But well, attention everyone. Okay. Attention everyone! Animal Pal Stevie is on vacation this week. I'll be taking over for him, which means I get to take care of the panda babies! For those of you who don't know, Stevie usually looks after the red panda nursery. But now it's all me! But now it's me. All me, baby! As you can tell, I'm very excited! Eee! Well, why are you saying attention, everyone? Like, you know, like, attention, Kmart shoppers! Even though Kmart isn't relevant anymore. Are you almost like that guy from Yu Gi Oh! Abridged? Attention, duelist! My hair and everyone have an announcement to make! I take it this is a mass text? Oh, now. Okay, now it makes sense. Congratulations, Amelia. No, I'm gonna call her out on it. I like it when you make more personal texts to me. Yes! Alright, well... I mean, now it makes sense, but still, I'm just here like, what? I sent this to the entire contact list, including the Chinese takeout restaurant down the street and my dentist receptionist. I'm just that excited about newborn pandas. They have the teensy weensiest little paws and the most adorable, most boobable little noses, and I love them. Hold on, I'm crying. Oh my... It takes you 15 minutes to... Uh, well. I guess if I'm being real here, it's taken me like 15 minutes to cry and calm myself down in the most emotional states, especially like... Did I mention to everyone how Doki Doki Fallen Angel seriously broke me to the point where... Like, God, I don't know how long I was crying for. Oh well. I guess I'll just wait it out. You know, a part of me kind of wonders, what's more painful? Times where you have to wait 15 minutes? Or 15 hours plus? Because, I mean, at least the 15 minutes, it's just so minuscule that... Do you really want to spend that many diamonds versus the 15 hours? Anyway, well... 15 minutes of crying later... Phew! Okay, I have managed to get a hold of myself. Same. Except I was crying over how adorable you are. If you need help with that, I could always hold you. I don't know. Plus, I still need to know what you're holding over me. What is this secret that you won't tell me about myself that I don't know of? Oh, <laughs> that was super smooth. You're ridiculous, and so incredibly sweet. I know. Try to be all Han Solo. Or, I try. Let's try to be a little more modest this time. Just a little. Flirtation skills enhance. Or, flirtation skills enhance. Alright, I'm heading into the nursery now, so if I don't respond... It's because I've died from acuteness overload. Understandable. Have a nice day. Please don't die, we haven't gone out on a date yet! Now I'm gonna be like, understandable. This almost sounds like something I would say. You know, as a joke, whatever. Just be like, okay, understandable. <laughs> I'm certain I will. Alright. 
Okay, yeah, now this is... It seems like Amelia, in her own way, is trying to be the new honey. Uh, Well... Seriously, well... If I didn't have to delete Fire Emblem Heroes from my phone because... Of that stupid update where it's like, oh, oh, you can only play this game now if you have iOS 13 or higher. And here I am, stuck with my iPod and phone at iOS 12.5. Then at least it would help make the time go a little bit faster for me, but... now yeah, seriously, I don't get why. I mean, I guess in some ways it's just to match up with the operating system and... Little things like that, but at the same time I'm here like, come on. What about us poor schlubs who can't update our iOS just because? Like, are you seriously expecting me to buy a whole dang new device just to play that one game? As if, oh, okay, let me see, I have maybe a thousand dollars to spare, I can do that easy. I'm not one of those people, so... Anyway, I guess I'll see you later. Or, well, rather, I'll see you in a bit. Okay, Amelia. Seriously, are you really trying to be the new honey here in your own way? Goodness gracious! Sweet googly moogly. Okay, what happened? This is a lot more... complicated than I expected! What? Oh my... Okay, it's official. She is trying to be the new honey. God dang it. I feel like... Yeah, like, in a sense, I'm being ripped off in a way. <laughs> First, I had to wait 15 minutes. Got a few conversation bubbles. Then I have to wait 5 minutes. Got like 3 conversation... Or no, 2 conversation bubbles. Now I have to wait 10 minutes. The recording is 25 minutes long as of now, and... I've spent a good chunk of that just sitting here. You know, just going through my phone and whatever. <laughs> like, I'm, I'm not even doing anything, practically. I'm just... Yeah, I think this is slightly more annoying than what Honey did at the end. At the very least, I could just have left the game going and whatever, which I did back then. Here, well, it's like, I have to wait these short little increments of time, and... I'm just here like, oh god, well, you know, and there's really... There's no point in using diamonds just because, I mean, I'd have to be using five every single time. But, I mean, you can use five diamonds for eight measly minutes, or five hours. Which I think is a bit more worth it, so... Yeah. I would be even more ripped off if I did just use diamonds. Dang it, I... S I almost feel like... You know, I almost feel like a lot of these phone flings have kind of redeemed a lot of characters in a way, just making them more interesting and whatever like it did with me for Lake. But in this case, it almost feels like it's having the opposite effect on me and Amelia. As it is, Amelia didn't really stick out all that much in my mind. Aside from me f affectionately calling her Amelia Vidalia. Otherwise, like, yeah. So, in a way, it is like you're trying to... After Honey became, as some of the people on Reddit put it, stupid hot, now it seems like you're trying to take her place and being, like, the one who gets on my nerves. I mean, I still haven't totally forgiven her for what she did in the first Phone Fling, but at the same time, this is probably just as annoying, if not more annoying. 
You might say it's so annoying that it's got me ranting for almost four minutes straight. That's how annoyed I am. Here I am, like, almost 28 minutes into the recording, and I've probably only spent less than eight minutes actually talking or doing anything. God damn. <laughs> Okay, well... I'm very tempted to just name this episode... Episode 152, Amelia is the New Honey. I don't know if... Veterans of the channel might understand that joke, but anyone else will probably be like, Huh, what does that mean? They'll probably think that, Oh my god, does that mean she's, that she's gonna turn, like, stupid hot in the end? It's like, Nope, she's just gonna be... Utterly annoying with those stupid waiting time in between, and it's just getting me so annoyed. Okay, honey, I mean, Amelia. Oof, I wish I had an extra pair of hands. I wish you weren't taking notes from honey on how to annoy me. <laughs> I have hands, and I'd happily let you use them however you like. Stevie made it look easy, huh? Yeah, I don't feel so flirty anymore. I may be developing a new appreciation for his skills, yes! Seriously, how does he always look so relaxed? I was supposed to be bottle feeding the little guys right now. But Orso keeps climbing out of the playpen. Bowtie is upset because he has the hiccups, and Noodle won't stop trying to burrow into my shirt. I like Noodle. I approve of Noodle's MO. That sounds chaotic and adorable. That is an accurate description. <laughs> I wish you were here to see it. It's like watching one of those old slapstick comedies. <laughs> On a side note, you're the only person still replying to me after that mass text I sent, so thank you. You're officially my new favorite person. Stop trying to butter me up. Okay, well... Now this one, I can justify- or no, I actually, no, I can't justify that. That's a whole day. See, why didn't you just do that to me in the first place, instead of stringing me along and making me waste almost half an hour of just sitting here doing almost nothing? Seriously. Yeah, I think it's official. I think I now rank Honey slightly higher than Amelia in terms of the phone fling girls that I like. Just for this little stunt alone. <laughs> okay, well, looks like... This is about... Wait a minute. Yeah, this is about a little under an hour, so one day and one hour, so... Okay, well... <laughs> Gosh... Yeah, I feel like I've been ripped off. Alright, well, anyway, yeah, I guess I will see you in the next part of this episode. Alright, well, a little over a whole day has passed. It's almost midnight now that I'm recording this. Judging by how I was recording, how I was recording yesterday, she should have been done at about like 8, 8.30, but anyway, well, I'm here now. So, what did you have me waiting for? Let's see. Okay, I think I've got everyone situated. Things seem to be calming down. It's bottle time! It's clobbering time! Okay, no, no clobbering anybody. Do I get it behind the scenes? That's great! I knew you could handle the situation! I'm still angry at you. 
I'll send you a pic. Oh my. Pictures of pandas doing cute things. It's like the number one perk of knowing me. Debatable. Pandas are great, but I'm also a huge fan of your personality and your face. Yeah, I. Uh, bah, yeah, it's really the only thing I'm interested in. Other than everything else about you. Eh, fine, I'll just. I'll be nice. Well, debatably nice. And. maybe some other parts of me too. Oh my. Cochina. <laughs> Not to sound ungrateful or anything. I'm glad you like my personality and my face. It's the foundation of a healthy relationship, probably. Possibly. Okay, let's see. I'm just waiting. Anyway, <laughs> check this out. Okay. Apparently they're pulling your uniform. I could imagine this photo would be a lot more revealing if this was the uncensored version. Noodle is so determined! To do what? To disrobe you or something? I don't blame him. You look like a whole seven-course meal. What? So funny and so cute. That pink bra really looks... Per looks really pretty on you. I don't want to say either of these things. Well, I just feel kind of weird saying... Uh, lesser of two evils, I guess. I don't know. God. <laughs> if you like me now, you should see me when I get all cleaned up. Like, for a date or something, you know? FYI, I'm exaggeratedly winking. <laughs> well, I can't see that. OMG, hold on. Where's Orzo? I was wondering why there were only two pandas in that picture. Uh-oh. Do we have a red panda cub on the loose? He's on the loose! Just... Hold on! Oh my... You seriously are trying to be Honey 2.0! You're lucky this kind of sort of falls into my realm of, like, kind of close to an hour, and... Seriously, what is this? I already got the, the picture, and now I have to wait for the conclusion to this? Well, the quote-unquote conclusion? Like, what even is this? Okay, yeah, it's official. Honey has been dethroned as my least favorite girl. Don't get me wrong, I mean, I still like her design and everything. She just seems so cute and happy and upbeat, and yet... What is this? What is this? Just... Why? Not even Honey tortured me this much. Just... Why? I mean, I get it's kind of going along with the story, but still, I'm just here like... Just... Why? Why? Okay, we found him. He totally escaped the pen. And was playing with the soap dispenser. The big one with the on the car wash side of the sanctuary. What the? Oh boy. One of my co-workers noticed an excessive amount of foam in one of the bays. Basically, wall-to-wall -wall froth. What do you have going on there? Let's see...
my English, my quote-unquote English teacher senses are going off right here, and I'm just like, he had totally escaped. I think it would have worked if you just left it at, he totally escaped. Too many past tense verbs here. Orzo came out with a little bubble beard and everything. At least he's clean now. Mischief managed. You're lucky I like Harry Potter references. These babies are more mischievous than Baka and Pip combined. Animal pal Stevie deserves a raise, that's for sure. The way you make it sound, he deserves like a medal of honor while you're at it. And you! You've been awesome! And you! You've been seriously working my patience! Only one other girl in this game has managed to do that, and I think you've completely dethroned her. Just knowing you were waiting made the whole day feel less stressful. Okay, well... Fine, I'll give you that. But, one of these days we'll have to talk when I'm not busy at work. So I can really give you my undivided attention. I do love attention. Nothing would make me happier than more time spent with you. Just don't try to be Honey 2.0 on me! I was almost a... If that was 14 minutes, I would have... Well, let's just say I would, I might have done like a bit of a angry sort of noise, but then I would have cut that out just because I'm just. Ugh. Oh. <laughs> hey, I'm Beat. Hello, Beat. I am Daniel. Do you mind if I say bye for now? I'll definitely message you again really soon. But for now, I'm gonna nap while the panda babies are napping. Don't tell my boss. Hey, boss. Did you know that Amelia's sleeping on the job? Okay, no. Mwah. Okay. Well, aside from me questioning all the little breaks and whatever... ...in between... I, that's probably just my... Like, I don't even know how to say what I want to say here. I mean, at this point, I looked at my footage, and at least, like, out of the 38, 40 minutes that I spent sitting there waiting for the time to go by, only 13 minutes of that is usable footage. Now, I mean, it, if you're not recording the game and whatever, I mean, that's fine. It's just on me, because, you know, the way I structure these videos and how... I record them, but I mean, it is just kind of like, it just feels a bit strange how most of the things that I cut out was just, it was just dead space of me doing nothing, and that ended up being at least two-thirds of the whole footage. Just literally me sitting here trying to be, you know, trying to keep my interest, you know, keep myself from getting bored while I'm sitting here. Which, I mean, at least compared to Honey and, well, even Copernicus, at the very least, I could have just, you know, s you know, sat it out, let the game run its course, you know, come back when the day's or a day, depending on was over, and then resume, but he was like, oh no, well, yeah, I don't know. And I would, like, it'll be, it would be kind of interesting to see how some of the people who play this on mobile might respond to it, and I don't know. Just because at least, like, sometimes when I do mobile games, I might wait out the time myself, 
or just... But then... At least, like, when I wait out stuff on mobile games, it's a little more consistent, versus here, you have no idea how long you might be waiting stuff out for. I don't know. That's my rant about it. I hereby crown you my least favorite girl of all the phone flings! Here's your crown, your majesty! You deserve it! I'll be taking that from you now. Here's your crown, your majesty! I hope you wear it with honor! And pride! And whatever third thing that I can't think of now. Why am I talking like this? I don't know. Anyway, well, I guess I'll see all you lovely folks later on. Stay golden, you beautiful people, and see you later. And now for something completely different. Ah! <laughs>